Welcome back. We have been shopping, so we thought we have quite a haul. We may as well do a haul video. Haul it out. Yeah, boy. We've been to many shops. Yeah. And the aim was really we were kind of holiday shopping, so that's kind of the vibe. We had a few other bits and bobs we needed to get, but we've mostly gone for holiday stuff. We'll just start with Primark. I am a person who loves to wear espadrilles in the summer. I'm not really a sandal person, so espadrilles are my thing. Primark have got their summer stuff truly out and espadrilles are in. And then I saw these ones. I've still got some of my espadrilles from last summer that I kind of wear until they die. But I saw these ones and tried them on and I loved them. So I actually had to buy two pairs because I know I wear them till they die. They're Minnie Mouse ones. Ah! They're so perfect and they're so comfy and they actually have like the ears and the bow and I'm just so excited about them. So I'm a size 6 and they were £10. So they're slightly pricier than some of the espadrilles but to be honest I've always been really impressed with Primark espadrilles. Don't know how many times I can say that word in a video. Okay, so I also bought two pairs of shoes, but they are different. Because we went to the gym before we went shopping, and I forgot to take a change of shoes. So I was in my scabby trainers that I've had since I was in <laughs> school. And they're also co covered in green paint from colour runs and stuff like that. So they're now in the bin outside. Oh, so I didn't know that. <laughs> yeah. So... We thought we'd get some trainers from Primark and we were looking and these seemed the best and they were the comfiest. I don't want to be one of those white trainer people, like, because I know I'm not going to keep them white. Fair it's enough. Just, but I am one of those people. But they got a bit of black on the back. Yeah, so. I thought they looked quite yeah. decent actually. So I'm a size 4 and these are £12. But I've got a pair of trainers, that's why I said to Maria to look in Primark because I've got a pair that I've had for a few years now from Primark and they're still going fine, they were cheap so I wasn't too like worried when I bought them if they lasted me a year, if they lasted me longer and they have lasted me longer so it's been good. And then the other pair I, or Naomi saw and we were just like oh my god. Yeah. Try them on, they're really comfy. And they are these. And if you can't tell, they're just little Mickeys on them. And it says Mickey on the back. They are so cute. They're really cute. They've almost got a bowling shoe vibe. What with that bit at the back? Yeah, I guess so. And yeah. I like they've got the thicker sole yeah. as well. Yeah, that's nice. So I will probably be wearing them in between my vans and stuff like that. In Florida. Yes. Uh, did you get anything else from Primark? I got one more thing. So I've picked this up for my dear pal Tara. She loves Winnie the Pooh and I found this in the shop and so she'd said to keep an eye out so this is so cute. They've got a few more Winnie the Pooh things in so I got that. That was £6. Really nice. It's kind of a little bit crop. Um, and then I got this yellow headband uh, this is going to be part of one of my Disney bounds for Florida yeah uh, you can see that video in a few weeks yeah and see who it's for yeah that completed a bound yes, that's that, all you needed that's now done okay so that was Primark done so we went to Scribbler now I really like Scribbler I can't say it properly but I need to get a few cards I should have used all of these by the time this video goes out so it's fine so I've got a friend's birthday coming up and I just thought this was really cute I love these kind of cards it's 275 and it's a Gemma Corel um, design so that's really cute I've got a three-year-old birthday party I like how sassy the unicorn is so mm. and it looks really bright and colorful and then this is my favorite purchase um, this is for um, Sylvia for her birthday. She's over in Hong Kong and I like to send cards. But I just love Kanye's smiling face anyway. It's one of my favourite things. 
because he's such a grumpy looking man and then he suddenly smiles and you're like oh my gosh there's true happiness and it says you're the Kanye to my Kanye because he just loves himself so I'm going to send that to Sylvia because she is my Kanye to my Kanye okay so I got this well done card it says well done you nailed it it's a hammer, <laughs> hammerhead shark so Cute. Yeah. I like the colours that's because someone got a job I got this one for Mother's Day. <laughs> it says, Mom, I'm so proud to be your kid. Your kid! <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah. We went to a little kind of, you know those one-off shops where they just sell, like, it's kind of like fancy dress, but also a bit Yeah, like, they do makeup, but they also do... It's a sort of place you buy a tutu. Yeah, <laughs> but I didn't see any tutus. Yeah, there were some tutus. Oh, nice. Okay. Or like a fascinator or something. Yeah. Like that. So, oh, it's called Bojangles in Norwich. So, if you know where that is, that's where this is all from. This is purely um, accessories for our Disney bounds. So, I've got a kind of dusty pink hairband thingamajiggy. Now, I always have to test these out because I've got a massive head. So if it fits on me, basically it could fit on anyone. I also, we both got these. Um, you hey, they're oh the my goodness! Match our That's so not planned, but perfect. So you might be able to guess this is a kind of Anastasia Drizella thingamajiggy. So I was very excited by these. And then is that all you got from there? Yeah. I also am bounding as Rapunzel. So I got a whole lot of hair flowers. Um, I don't know how I'm gonna put them in at the moment. This one will obviously go around the front, like like so. <laughs> Perfect. Looking good. And these ones will kind of go in the plait. Perfect. So I feel like a lot of Disney bounds have been ticked off. I also needed a red hair accessory. So yes, and it does fit. If anything, I might try and stretch it out a little bit, but like, there you go, it does go around my head. I'm just gonna have to make sure it's like, I won't wear it like this obviously, but you know, it does fit, you can see. I got myself a pair of sunglasses because I seem to manage to always break my decent sunglasses. Got these from Boots, they are Lipsy brand. And what I like in Boots is you get to pick up your own um, case for free. So it just comes with it. And what I like, I like big, as I always say, kind of celebrity glasses. So like the really big ones that they used to wear in like the noughties. I say bug eye. Um, and they've got <laughs> little like pearls and stuff here. And they say lipsy and look, boom, I'm a celebrity. For instant, instant fame, especially with this bit dangling like a, a glamorous celebrity. So yes, I got those, they're 35 pounds, but they're like proper, is it, what's it called, UV? Yeah. Yeah. Um, I, t I used to buy cheap sunglasses all the time and then realised I actually wasn't protecting my eyes at all. So I've kind of started to control that I buy them from proper places. I bought this for Florida, mostly. Um, so for the water parks. It's a swimming costume in case no one knew. <laughs> so it's really this is cute. the Oh My Disney, I think, range, is yeah. it not? So it's kind oh of like God. a t-shirt off the shoulder style and then it's got a halter strap. I just think it's like so, it's really so cute. cute. I love so all, all I have are racing, like, speedo swimming costumes. Yeah. So I want something The nicer. adult Disney range, that's amount of range that's coming out is just, like, perfect. It's so good at it's the so moment. Good. Well, Maria's biggest purchase <laughs> of the day. Um, it's a S10, Samsung S10. I traded in my old S8 for this. Yeah, your contract was pretty much up and yeah. you, they were messaging about upgrading. You did your research and decided, yep, yeah, gonna upgrade in time for Florida so that we got a bit of a fancier phone camera. I mean, obviously we're going to be taking our other cameras, but you know it's always convenient just to have a phone. 
I really like the colour. Yeah, it's really nice and you've already... I really like the colour, actually. Yeah, it's really nice, isn't it's it? It's pretty. You could always it's get... prism a... green. Prism green. Delightful. It almost, it like, colour coordinates with your jumper right now. Yeah. Right, so the rest of the things are joint things we bought together because we've, you know, how it is. So we, as I bought a three-year-old birthday card, we've got a birthday coming up. I am actually at the party as Elsa. So we bought a little animator Elsa. She is actually in the sale at the moment. She's down to £10. I haven't got any of this collection, but I do like them. I think they're cute. I think and they're I, good. I think she'll like her a lot. And it's quite different having the little girl one. So I'm hoping she recognises her. That's the only risk because she's not the classic Elsa. Yeah. But... I'll just let but her know. But she is like this in the film. She so. is like this in the film. And I think she's watched Frozen a lot. A lot, yeah. <laughs> so I think she'll really like her. The other thing, because we were really, ex I was really excited especially. Yeah, because she's three. She's finally so, three. So many toys now open up Our to three us. three plus. Yeah. So we've got her her first animator and we've gone for Tinkerbell because again, I didn't want to do another Elsa because I'm Elsa. not as keen no. on the Elsa Her face animator. isn't right. It's just not right. So we decided to go for Tink because when she was very small, as in one, less than one, I think, I bought her a Tink costume from Disneyland Paris. And so she does know who Tinkerbell is. And I just love this Tink Which is anyway. So perfect. So I'm really excited for her to finally have one of these. Okay, and then we bought some <laughs> Astonish. We, yeah, we've gone. Like, that's the fun stuff. Now we're on to the, we went to Savers. And I think most of this is now from we Savers. We some boot stuff There's and some body There's a bit shop. of body shop. But this is all now practical stuff. So yes, we bought some Astonish. We, I don't know about you, but I, I've noticed some of our windows, I think it's a change in temperatures, are getting a little bit mouldy. So I got some mould and mildew blaster because I just want to get on top of it. I don't want it to be a thing. I think I buy this in every like shopping haul we do. Again, it was 89p. That speaks to me. If it's less than a pound, I'll buy it. It's those strawberry laces. We always get that one. And I like to just have a spare in case I run out. And we've got this pack. This specific one. You've got it upside down. Oh, so disturbing. This specific pack of cotton round for the house. Yes, because we had to, <laughs> with our sisterly ways, we bought two. So we had to split it. Um, these are Primark ones. So Maria bought one for the holiday. I bought one for home, just so it was so absolutely we, yeah. fair. Holiday shampoo. We got Aussie Mega. We both love Aussie. Yeah. I use hair like shampoo conditioner everything like all my hair products pretty much yeah are Aussie we also got a Garnier ultimate blends um three in one mask for our hair yeah, so it's, it's coconut, coconut milk. milk and macadamia we got our oh. roll-on deodorants we got two one for home one for holiday exciting times <laughs> you can guess which color is who <laughs> not that we try to coordinate it all and a spray just in case we stink body wash this is mango and papaya i love fruity yes, this smells this is imperial leather yeah and what i like is these were the same mm. price as the normal imperial ones and this has got how much extra 60 percent extra we got toothbrushes yeah so at home we use electric toothbrushes so we just thought it'd be easier waka We've also got some tooth. Hey! <laughs> We've also got some toothpaste to take with us, just so we're sorted. No problems. Painkillers. We are basically ibuprofen. We ordered some painkillers in our food shop. We bought some today. We are stocking up because basically. I There's think nothing we're... worse than getting a headache and then yeah. feeling rubbish. So... And we're going to kind of push our bodies at yeah <laughs> we're gonna be busy we're gonna be out a lot we're gonna be tired and i i've got a headache right now i'll be honest we've been shopping for most of the day and i feel like i'm borderline migraine but i've taken some paracetamol it's not done much i'm gonna have to take some ibuprofen as well just to relax my eyeballs um and i can't risk having that happen every day in florida mm. so i need to have plenty of stuff speaking of risks 
<laughs> well, I'm just going to dive in and say we've got a whole stash of um, antihistamine. antihistamine because I have, we both get hay fever, I get it pretty bad and I also have very sensitive skin. So quite often, out of nowhere, I'll have an allergic reaction to something and my lips will like go all like swollen and stuff. Um, <laughs> it looks like Botox. I look stunning when it happens, but you know, yeah, it's not with fun. that and your sunglasses. People will be like, oh my gosh, Madonna. <laughs> <laughs> so I bought some Zantac and Boots own heartburn and indigestion relief <laughs> because my ways sometimes I can't eat what I want to eat. So this way I'm just planning to eat everything and I don't want any restrictions on that. So fair enough. Yeah. And also I've got some Dextro energy things because I get low blood sugar sometimes. So <laughs> we won't be able to contain her. So we both got um the same new mascara. We decided maybe it's Maybelline. Maybe it's not. It is. It is. <laughs> we got Total Temptation. Now I always go for waterproof mascara. I don't. My reason being is I actually cry quite a lot and I never know when I'm going to cry so I have to always be prepared. I got, <laughs> this is where it all comes out, I've been feeling really anxious recently, really highly stressed to the point that I've not been sleeping, everything's in my head, I've said to Maria several times I can't cope and she's had to help me write this. So I got some calms because we swear by calms. I don't it's... know if they work. I'll be honest, I don't, I don't know, know if they work. But they taste nice. And, and they may have a placebo effect. Yeah, I tend to think they do help. And then we got some suntan cream. We got the pack because it seemed a better deal. Yeah. So we, it, they're all repel and protect. So they got some bug repellent in them as well. So we've got a 30, a 50 plus and an after sun. Yeah, just to... Keep safe because we've just I looked at pasty the... faces. <laughs> well, I'm hoping to get a bit of a tan because I am, I am so pale at yeah, the moment. I can't remember being this pale last year. I don't year. think I've ever been this pale. No, it's ridiculous. But we looked at the weather and it was like a high of 26 today. So I was like, yep, 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 yep. So it's good. <laughs> we like these um, makeup packs for makeup removers or even face wipes whatever you call them from Primark you get it's a like amazing deal because it's only one pound and you get three packs of them also on that we got some face wash that we're going to share when we're away and we got body shop aloe vera calming foaming wash which again is for sensitive skin I've been using it anyway not this one I've got my own and it cleans my face I don't have sensitive skin, but it still does the job, so yeah. we might as well use it. Yeah. And it works really nicely. And I haven't seen these before in Body Shop. This is the final thing, by the way. Um, a hand cleansing gel. And I love the Body Shop, Body Shop scents. And I think I like Body Shop. It's like, good. So we got the Pink Grapefruit Hand Cleanse Gel. Now, I tried one on in the shop. I say I tried it on like it's a top or something. But I tried one on my hands and afterwards my hands felt really soft. Mm. I find cleansing gels tend to dry out your hands. Yeah, hand sanitizer is really cruel, like yeah. harsh. Yeah, and I normally, I've really? always got cuts on my hands because of my eczema. And I normally, like, I'm like, oh, the pain. Whereas with this, I wasn't. And it does really smell nice. Okay. So, very random, full, get away from me. <laughs> very random shop with lots of bits and bobs, but we're... Yeah, I mean, we pretty much got most of the things on our list. We had two pages of lists, and I think there were only four things we didn't get that we wrote yeah. down. So, yes, thank you for joining us, and we will see you very soon. Goodbye. Goodbye.